by an ordinary potato? I hope so, boys and girls, but this is going to be a really boring episode. The supplies will need... Why can't we watch DuckTales? Because we don't learn anything watching DuckTales. It's TV. We aren't supposed to learn. Two alligator clips, and let's see. Of course, a clock. Missy, go somewhere else. I need to talk to you, brother. Why don't you go somewhere else, and I can watch the... No! I hate everybody. It's time for science. Hey, he was about to power a clock with a potato. Not possible. Now, listen. Am I in trouble? No. Maybe. Just listen. You're not going to make it in this school if you keep ratting people out. But they were breaking the grooming codes and the dress codes. I saw one boy with a T-shirt that said, Bite me. Yeah, that, that's terrible. Sheldon, let me tell you a little story. Did you ever wonder why we moved from Galveston to Medford? No, I tend to wonder about the Baker questions. OK, well, here's why. Your dad had a real good coaching job. And I saw some grown-ups breaking rules. What'd they do? Yeah, it's kind of complicated. Football coaches aren't allowed to recruit kids from other high schools to play on their teams. And you told on them? Yeah. You know what happened? Justice descended upon the rule breakers? I got fired, Sheldon. And I got a bad reputation. Oh, that's why you drink so much beer. Just do yourself a favor, OK? Go to school tomorrow and mind your own business, all right? Dad, are you sad that you got fired? Mostly angry. But yeah, maybe a little sad. All right, let's say grace. That was the first time I held my father's hand. I wouldn't touch my brother's hand until 17 years later, thanks to the invention of Purell.